Hey, what up, Ty 1822? You know Chris Brown been in a lot of shit lately. Uh, with the uh, the girl took a picture of him on her iPhone, and Chris Brown took it. Man, this dude right here, you know, lately he been you know, of course, been a dickhead as usual. I mean, everybody know Chris Brown. Chris Brown's a straight bitch anyway. We all know the situation with Rihanna. You know him and Sam Pump. So, you know, I never got the chance to mention the Rihanna shit with Chris Brown because I wasn't making videos. But this time, I'm making videos now. So, of course, I'm going to go on on Chris Brown. So, Chris Brown is a street bitch, you know. Uh, you know, he hit Rihanna last year. I mean, what, two years ago? Yeah, two years ago, I think. Yeah, two years ago. I mean, he messed the chick face up. Now, before, the, uh, the, before I found out the pictures, I'm like, okay, okay, you know, damn, he hit her. But, okay, I wasn't going that crazy about it. But when I saw her face, I'm like, God damn, Chris Brown. I mean, come on. You beat her bad. I mean, I don't think there's any woman in this world who say something bad to a guy to end up looking like that, like Rihanna. And, you know, I, of course, everybody is not perfect in this world. You know, everybody not perfect. But Chris Brown, for some reason, since he went to his Grammys now, he's like, oh, fuck the haters and all that bullshit. Okay, so he won a Grammy. That means I got to respect him as a man? Hell no, I don't respect no man that beats a woman like that. I mean, come on, Chris Brown. You ain't shit for that, man. You beat Rihanna down like she's some goddamn man. And I guarantee you, Chris Brown would never do that to a man the way he touched a Rihanna. And... Chris only really get forgiveness because, of course, his fanboys and his female fans. You know what? They not. I'm not gonna call them females. You know why? Because when I heard them on the radio, they were like, "Oh well, I will let them hit me." Rihanna maybe had it coming. You know what? Those not women. Those are bitches. He got bitches for fans, not women. Because the way those chicks were sounding like, man, I'm like, they sound so ignorant, man. Oh, she maybe she deserved it. I want my Chris Brown hitting me. Oh, cause only reason why Chris Brown get uh you know get a pass from them, cause he could sing a goddamn song and dance. I mean, come on, I'm not gonna elevate nobody that high, cause he could sing. Hell no, Chris Brown is human, and he know what he did was fucked up. I mean, so if I could sing a song, ooh ooh ooh, bow, punch a chick in the face, should I get should I get forgiveness, cause I could dance and sing? Hell no, I'll get forgiveness for punching uh, you know a chick in the face. I don't get that shit. So the the, the regular nine to five man could punch a chick in the face, beat her down. Oh, he get all the heat. But a guy who could sing and dance and win a Grammy gets a big ass pass by a lot of fans. And you got a lot of people who don't like Chris Brown, and I understand why. But most of these people only gave him forgiveness because who cause who he is as a performer. It had nothing to do. Okay, well it looked like okay it looked like he he uh you know he trying to. You know, change himself and all that. They not it's not cause that it's just cause he can sing and dance and that's it. If Chris Brown changed or not, I don't give a fuck. But it's it's still it's still the it's the point is that he beat down Rihanna like she was a goddamn man. And that's the part I respect about Chris Brown. I mean if you would do that, do that to a man. I bet you can't cause I bet a guy would knock Chris Brown ass out cold right now. But Chris Brown's a pussy. He won't fight a man. He only go up the women and that's all he can do. And if you a dude and, you know, you support Chris Brown, go ahead. I mean, go ahead and support the motherfucker. Because I can't, ain't no need for me to change your mind. Go ahead. If the dumb bitches want to support Chris Brown, go ahead. Because y'all the same dumb bitches who like being knocked up in the head too. So that's one thing I won't go crazy about. Because there's a lot of women out there, no, sorry, a lot of bitches out there who love to be hit by guys. And those ones are Chris Brown supporters. I mean, I just don't get it, man, because... Cause the man can sing and dance, and you get a, you get a pass. And a lot of people are like, who are you to talk about Chris Brown? Well, hold up, Chris Brown not saving lives. I mean, he, he. I mean, I respect firemen, you know, who save people's lives from burning buildings. I'm not gonna respect Chris Brown because he can sing a goddamn song and dance and win Grammys. Hell no. I'm not gonna worship him for that because he could do that. A lot of people could do that shit too. He's not the only person in the world who's a singer who has success. There's a lot of them have that shit. But I'm not going to worship those people because they could do that shit. It's about who you are as a human being. That's what it's about. Not because you could sing or dance. I don't give a fuck about that, what Chris Brown would do. He could do all that shit he wants. But at the end of the day, Chris Brown's still a straight bitch. Straight pussy. And that's what Chris Brown is. So I don't, I don't give a damn about being called a hater. Because it's not about his career. It's who he is. Now, of course, nobody's perfect in this world. But... Chris Brown come off as a motherfucker like, oh, I told y'all, I told y'all, fuck y'all, fuck y'all. Because he won a Grammy. 
So he goes on Twitter and put that tweet out like, fuck y'all. So, and you win a goddamn Grammy. I'm still talking shit still. I'm still talking shit. Don't, I, I mean, I don't give a fuck what Chris Brown will do. He could win the hot dog competition next week. I don't give a fuck. Fuck Chris Brown. I mean, like I said, a lot of the bitches love Chris Brown. And they the ones, uh, Rihanna had it coming. He could hit me. You don't know who Chris Breezy is. Those the bitches. You had his fanboys too. Oh, oh, dog, you don't know about Chris Brown. And I don't gotta know about him. He still put his hand on Rihanna. I mean, come on. He still did it. This dude a bitch, man. I mean, it's it's the truth. He's a straight bitch. And every real guy know he's a straight bitch. Because they all know he wouldn't touch us. I mean, real guys know Chris Brown wouldn't touch them. But you know, his little fanboys, they will suck his dick anyway, so they don't care. But real men know damn well that they came up to Chris Brown's face. He wouldn't do anything to them. And, he, and that's a damn truth right there. Real men know that. That Chris Brown would never put their hands, he would never put his hands on none of them. But when it comes to a female like Rihanna, yeah, he did that shit. Now, one thing about Rihanna, I'm not surprised about them getting back together. Rihanna, just another chick, got her ass beat and went to another dude. So, people, don't be surprised about Rihanna going back to Chris Brown. Because that shit was expected anyway. You know, they might, maybe they love each other. Like they said, sometimes people like that deserve each other. You know, you never know. Chris Brown might whoop her ass next week, next year. You never know. Hey, that's what she want. That's what you want, Rihanna. Hey, I'm, I can't tell nobody who to love. She loves Chris Brown. We all know they're back together. But Chris Brown, you a street bitch. And that's all I wanted to say. Your fanboys, eh, y'all can suck a dick all y'all want. Because y'all only forgiving him because he's Chris Breezy. And the bitches only loving him because he can sing and dance. So that's all I wanted to say. Don't forget, hit the subscribe button. I am out. Peace.